So this is the spearmint that I have planted in here. Excuse the wind. And on this one, there's some spots, okay? Many, many spots in Eden parts. It was not doing so well. It's just deficient in something. I didn't know what. Okay. Didn't know what. But essentially, you see all these little ones coming out from below, just prospering and looking amazingly good. But what happened with that? I took some magnesium sulfate and I added about one tablespoon to one gallon of water and I gave this plant a portion of this water and well I think it was three four days after I did this and look at that look at this abundance coming out just enjoying that magnesium now one thing to learn about magnesium is that in the core of the chlorophyll which is the active of sight, okay, within the plants that it transmutes the light and all the other elements into sugar and nourishment. Inside the chlorophyll itself, the atomic structure is a magnesium ion that is considered the active site and kind of ignites that um, chlorophyll. So that's why when you eat something as rich as a green plant very vibrant it has a lot of chlorophyll in it and that means that you get a lot of magnesium from it so it makes you even thrive because magnesium is very much essential for so many things inside of us well i hope you guys learned something about magnesium and sulfates itself also sulfates you find in dna they pretty much have a lot to do with the structure itself and sulfates have a lot to do with a lot of other structures within organisms. Um, also a good topic to explore. So, yeah, there you go. Blessings.